We're asking HVAC techs common questions from homeowners. What's your name? Drew. Drew. Okay, nice to meet you, Drew. Here's a good question for you. If I need to clean out my own HVAC drain line, how much vinegar do I put down? National average is about a cup of vinegar, but I'm a little extreme. I use basically a, one of those water bottles and I fill it up to the label and I'll use that whole water bottle. So it's okay to have some excess then? Yeah, you can't really overdo it. Okay, but not the whole bottle? I would not. Now, bleach <laughs> is a little different story, but with vinegar, you're pretty much safe with whatever you want to put in there. Is it bad to see a small puddle outside my home from my drain line? If uh, it's a swimming pool? That's not a good sign. If there's nothing coming out of it, that's not a good sign, but you definitely want to see that humidity removal from your house. So that's going to end up having some moisture out there. Okay. So it's not uncommon to see some water. Definitely not. Is it bad to keep the system really cold? Well, it's again, going to depend on extremes. Like my wife, she keeps my house at 68 degrees. Really depends on how much you want that utility to be at the end of the uh, month. How do you tell if my AC is backing up into my sink or if it's a plumbing issue? That's a really good question. Uh, what I usually tell customers is to fill up their sink with water. Just pull the little stopper down and fill it completely up and then let it go. If that sink still holds that water, it's a plumbing issue. If it's draining out, then it sounds like you might have a, a backed up drain line. A lot of my customers are on the fence of tune-ups. Mm -hmm. So say I'm on the fence of tune-ups, change my customer's mind. Okay, well, that's a great question. We get this all the time. What you really want to do is have someone come out because we do hear the horror stories and we never want that to be you of drain lines backing up, causing ceiling damage, parts going out in the middle of summer. People were waiting weeks to get someone out there. It's best to just get it done in the off season so we can get it taken care of so you don't have to call us in the middle of summer. Well, there you go. That's our technicians here at Radiant. You have any issues, call Radiant.